Hey everyone, Shoshana here with Jelani Remy outside of Ain't Too Proud. How are you feeling? Hi everybody, happy holidays. I am feeling the Christmas spirit because it is what? December 1st, which December. means Christmas is just around the corner. And I'm more sort of feeling the holiday spirit because I, Jelani Remy, am doing my own Christmas concert. Uh, Monday, December 13th at the Lortel Theater. I am so excited about it because um, as we've spoken throughout the whole pandemonium, panacotta, pangea, if you will, um, will. we got into, I, I was home with my family and we have such rich Caribbean roots. Well, my mom's from Barbados and my dad's from Trinidad and they actually met in New York City. And so um, I decided this year I wanted to do a holiday special and sort of incorporate my Caribbean roots. So I am doing Tis This Season with Jelani Remy, which is your holiday favorites with some Caribbean flavor as well as some authentic, authentic Trini Bajan flair. So I have steel pan, I have background singers, I have, I have all the recipes for a perfect holiday show. Um, and not only that, oh. I have some special guests that I would love to announce. I have Joelle Blackman from Hades Town, Who I just saw as Persephone and is magical. And if you ever hear she's going on again, you have to go. Oh, she is a dream. She's a dream and she's part of the lineup. She is of Trini descent as well. So when she wrote me saying, I have to be in your show, I was like, yeah. Yes, and also, None other than St. Aubin of Ain't Too Proud, who plays Dennis Edwards, is Guyanese, and he's going to be part of our show as well. And he's he is doing one of my favorite songs, so I don't want to tell oh. you, you got to come to find out. And it is Monday, December 13th at 7 p.m. at the Lortel Theater. You can get your tickets at tinsel.org. We love a good plug. So this sounds absolutely fabulous. Now, I filmed your last concert at 54 Below, and anyone who has seen that or who has seen you perform at all knows that a Jelani Remy concert is not to be missed. I mean, I don't want to toot my own horn, but toot toot. Um, I, I have a good time because I love to be in the moment and anything and everything can and will happen. But I mostly like to do things from the heart, you know, and that's the beauty of what we get to do out, outside of our shows. Um, spreading a little love and cheer and a positive message and, and music that comes from the heart is, is just what we all need because we've all been missing this human connection and this show at the Lortel is no exception to that. Yes, we are so excited about that. So let's talk about Broadway is back. It is. It, it is. It, it is. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. We are always ready for a Broadway show. Oh my. Well, you are the B-Way show, okay. and you have done such amazing work covering all the amazing moments that we had. I just saw you recently at the Sondheim event. Which was so emotional, and I'm so glad we got to connect there. Yeah, absolutely. And it was more so seeing the entire Broadway community gather together to lift up this icon. And that got me thinking that how lucky we all are to be back in our homes, you know, doing our shows and doing what we're, what we're meant to do. So we're so happy to be back on Broadway bigger and better than ever. Definitely. And I will add to that, I want to give a special shout out to everybody who's buying the tickets and coming to see the show. Your energy is infectious and contagious and it is it is truly, truly, truly the magic that we've all been missing. Yes, I was at the, the final dress rehearsal here and there was this energy at Ain't Too Proud that was unlike anything else. Every song, like huge applause, standing ovations. What does it feel like knowing that your friends, families, and fans from everywhere in the world are coming back to see you? Well, it feels like I work with some of the most talented people on Broadway, you know, in this show. Like the, 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 the energy and the commitment and just the storytelling we're doing is like none other. And we all sort of got to rebuild the show together. You know, uh, and, and it's, we all took a second to breathe and then reconnect and put it all back together and it translates to the stage for sure. You know, because when everything was taken away, every, we, we realized that nothing is promised. So every show is, is the first and the last, you know what I mean? So we wanna make sure we give everybody something to remember and especially a story like The Temptations. Um, we got to sort of live what they went through, you know, with the social injustices and, and, and you know, trying to be one nation, you know, and now one world. So to be able to step into that character, all of the characters, and to be able to tell that story again with a first-hand feeling of how that feels is, is pretty, pretty remarkable. Yeah. Ain't Too Proud is just such a special show, and you even have the snow globes out in Times Square. Honey, we are in Times Square rotating like rotisserie chicken. Come check us out on 46th and Broadway. <laughs> well, I'm being with, with one spinning around. <laughs> but so it's great. awesome, but it's also that Christmas spirit. And I also got to see the Lion King one as well. So know, there's something for everyone here. out there. So please go see the snow globes as well. But honestly, the rotisserie chicken thing that makes me laugh. That was so good. And I'm very much in the holiday spirit. We are in the midst of Hanukkah. Oh, L'chaim. Hanukkah. L'chaim. L'chaim. Yes. Yes, we are in the holidays, whatever you are celebrating. Tradition. <laughs> <That's> tradition. <laughs> Tradition. <laughs> so another thing that we are celebrating is that you just won this fabulous, fabulous, I mean, the best singer, this this song is so beautiful. So 
Come so on. I'm huge in France, you guys. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. It actually, was well, damn. Goes, it goes along the lines of saying like that nothing is promised, and, and we have to sort of live every day like it's our last, and live it to the fullest. And creating music has been something that I've always been excited about, but always a little nervous to do. And so with this whole you know time off, I decided you know what? Why not? Nothing. Why not put yourself out there? So I. I Partnered up with my good friends Justin Long and Joanna Burns, and um, we found a wonderful director, Brandon Burks, and put together this amazing track called Gone Forgotten Year, which is exactly what it's about, forgetting that last year and being able to reconnect with the one that you love again. Oh, it's so beautiful. I was watching the YouTube video, and Josh Breckenridge is there! I want to save the best for last. We have the amazingly, beautifully talented Josh oh. Breckenridge as my love interest. Okay! In in the movie. I say it's a movie. It feels like a movie, but it's yeah. a music video. Yeah. And he's just the perfect breath of fresh air. And what it is, it celebrates black love. It celebrates, you know, that enough said, period. You know what totally. I mean? Totally. Why? I mean, we need more of that. It's so beautifully done. What did it feel like to get to get that announcement, to get that award? See, um, it was just, it was a win for the team, yeah. you know? And it wasn't yeah. just for me, it was for the whole team. And that's what's most exciting about it. And to know that someone in the world was affected by this, not just in my bubble. Um, it, it means a lot. It means a lot and it's a fuel to keep going. It's a fuel for all of us to sort of keep going and putting yourself out there and, and stretching your horizons because you never know where it can take you. And Cannes Film Festival, like that's legit. We, oui, we, oui. I, you know. We, oui, we, oui, more not me. Okay, but I'm so thankful. So thank you to the Cannes Film Festival and thank you to Justin Long, Joanna Burns and the entire team that helped put this work together. Yeah. So are there any other messages that you want to share with your fans watching at home? Yes. Have a safe and happy holiday season. And I hope to see you at the Imperial. I hope to see you at the Lortel. Hope to see you in the Snow Globes. Yeah! <laughs> but also, I love seeing b oh, show. Thank you, my love. I love seeing you everywhere. What a joy to be able to reconnect, celebrate the holidays together, and congratulations on everything. Thank you. Can we do a tradition dance together? Tradition! Tradition! tradition. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you at the show.